What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Thanks for clicking on the video. So today, what I'm gonna show you guys is how to completely disable the traction control on a Q60. So I've had people ask me all the time like, hey, I turned my traction control off, but something starts blinking again when I start losing traction. And there's a way to completely turn your traction control off. Now, there is the traction control button that's right next to your steering wheel. That's right here. But that is not how you turn it completely off. When you click that button, it still leaves Stabila Track on. And what Stabila Track does is when it feels the the car kicking out or moving sideways, it will activate a, a sort of traction control still, which will help bring the car back straight. Now, what I'm gonna do is this, okay, so once you click the traction control button, you're gonna have these two things that come up. It's gonna be traction control off, and then it's gonna turn off um, your sensor in the front that helps you with traffic. So, I'm gonna input a picture here of what the but of what the button looks like. You'll see it up here. So, basically, the button is under the brake pedal. So it's a white button. You're gonna press the brake pedal. Once you press the brake pedal, you're gonna hold this button, and this button is going to add another or take off another level of traction control. So let's get down there. You can't do it while you're driving. I've tried. It's super hard. You got to do it. On get down under in the car and do it so let's get that started okay so if you guys can see here you'll see right here there's this little black black button type deal uh, for the pressure sensor for your brake pedal now if you press your brake pedal down you now expose to get this to focus come on camera well you guys can see it you'll see this white button right here now, if you can stick your finger in there and press that button down, hold the button down for five seconds, and then this will happen. So, you guys, let me close the door. So before, you were missing this uh, indicator. So once you press that down, now that means that your traction control is completely disabled, and you can go ahead and do your burnouts or whatever you wanna do. Me personally, when I had my drag slicks on the car and I was at the drag strip and I was staging and on my launch control, I would let off of the brake and what it was doing was it would like sense the grip of the tire and it would like bog the launch and I wasn't able to launch on that sticky of a tire. I had a Mickey Thompson uh, ET Street R. But now with all of them off, when I was at the drag strip and I would get on the launch control and I would let off, the car would hook and book like no other. So, the quick little informational video, that's how you turn the traction control off. That's how you can do like burnouts and drifting. I'll, let me, I'll put a video in right here of me doing some, some donuts. <laughs> And that was with the traction control completely off. If you tried to do that with just clicking the traction control button and not the one under the pedal, you probably wouldn't be able to do that. So, thanks for clicking the video. Quick inspiration, uh, inspirational, <laughs> quick informational video. Thank you guys for watching. Okay, so let me do a quick launch for you guys now. Launch control is way better with the traction control fully disabled. 